Hello there, my good friends of YouTube. Well, guys, <clears throat> I've got some awesome to show you. Now, of course, I've got a few different things running in my videos at the moment. I like to try and mix things up a bit. I don't want you guys being bored. And plus, I enjoy sharing them with you as well. Um, so, I've got something a little bit different for you today. Um, so I'm blowing balls, not long, just that chewing gum. And uh, <clears throat> still blowing balls and I haven't even got the chewing gum in my mouth. <laughs> so, yeah, check this. Oh, it's a laser. Now I've got two of these bad boys. I've got two of them given to me by a very good friend of mine. And, of course, I shan't name any names because he likes to name, be anonymous. But he knows that. <laughs> I've had him for quite some time off him, and uh, I've been, uh, you know, trying to find the best time to try and mess about with this, these things, and I've got now got one all nicely prepared. So let's fire it up. Got about 10, 12 kV running through it, through a little transformer that I built there. So let me just let me just pause this while I open it. I'm sure you recognise those. Yep. That is a microwave oven transformer, rewound primary and secondary. And of course it's full of mineral oil. Uh, I've not run that uh, little beauty for quite some time. I've got a, just changing the subject, I've got another one there which, down there which I've wound, which needs some oil. And I've got another one there which I wound quite some time ago as well. So yeah, I like to keep hold of little things like that. Instead of just using a flyback, I like to change me settings with something different that I've probably made myself. But anyway, let's power this up. So that's the spot where one's going to hit. And if you guys can see that yellow spot there, that's where the other one's going to hit, hopefully. So here we go. Oh, God, look at that thing. That thing is... Oh, cut that lot. Let me turn the lights down for you. In fact, let me put this one on and turn it down. And then I can turn these other two off. There we go. There we go. Hold on a minute, something. Oh, I've bloody turned my power off. What a bum hole. Right, now it should be on. Yep. When I switched the LED lights off, I switched it off at the plug, at the switch on the plug, and not just unplugged it. God, it's bright. So there's the other one, look. And there's the other one. Yep, you can definitely see that. So there's no x-rays coming from this because you would see it as snow hitting the camera's CCD. So, I don't really know much about these uh, lasers guys so any information would be fantastic so yeah <clears throat> so I'm not quite sure how many KV these actually take uh, I know the high voltage input uh, but uh, I'm putting about 12 KV into it at about 19 volts into my ZVS driver so it works out about 12 KV coming out of this I suppose if I change the different fields of capacitance, I suppose that one might have a, a, a difference on the output of the uh, laser. I'm not too sure because I haven't really dealt in these very much. But I'll tell you something though, that looks absolutely awesome. So bright. Let me show you what it says on the... Let's plug that back in. Let me show you what it says on the laser for you guys that are interested in this sort of thing there we go I'll just just turn it around there you go spectra come on focus you silly phone so this does not. Da, 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 da. I'm sure that's all boring, all the stuff at the bottom there. But it's made in USA. It's made my Spectra. So yeah, it's a quite a nice laser. Mm. 
It's pretty damn awesome, isn't it, guys? I don't know where my other one is, to be honest with you. I can't remember where I put it. Put it in one of these. Oh, God, no, not that drawer. It's not in that one, that one's fans. But I've got it somewhere, because I know normally when I... Is it in one of those drawers there? No. Oh, is it? No. I've got that much bloody stuff about. No, it's hanging about somewhere. If I find it, I shall show it in the next video. <clears throat> my half bridge. My full bridge. <laughs> and my water cooled. All ready for future videos, guys. I really need to do some induction, induction heating. I can't wait to do some of that stuff, guys. It's going to be awesome. So I thought to share that with you guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Look after yourselves, whatever you're doing. Please thumbs up or subscribe if you're new to my videos. Speak again. See you guys. How lovely. I just love RGBTs. They're so sick. <laughs>